What's happening everyone, Jay Shockblast here, and check it out. We have Simon Baz, one of the Green Lanterns of Sector 2814, along with Jessica Cruz. These are basically the two main Green Lanterns in DC's Green Lantern story at the moment. Now, Simon Baz is also very important. He is the first, uh, I, believe the fir I believe the first Muslim DC character. I know he's a Lebanese American, and yeah, I actually followed the story when he kind of was announced um, and he came out. Essentially, what happened is during the whole fallout from you know Blackest Night and Brightest Day, you know there was a kind of Sinestro ended up as a Green Lantern again, and he wasn't happy about it, and uh, neither, neither was anybody else. Basically, uh, essentially, at some point, him and Hal Jordan fused together uh, their Green Lantern rings and it came out and chose Simon Baz and unfortunately Simon Baz was in the process of driving a stolen vehicle that had a bomb in it and uh, it exploded and he became a terrorist or wanted terrorist he wasn't a terrorist he didn't have anything to do with it really um, but long and the short of it it was an interesting way to implement him you know, into the DC universe, and uh, it involved you know the Justice League searching for him. I mean, the ring kind of ripped him right out of the interrogation room. Uh, it, it was a pretty interesting story, to say the least. And uh, since then, he's basically kind of stuck on as uh, one of the the big, you know, Green Lanterns, even taking the seat with the Justice League. Um, he has a very unique uh, costume, which I really like. And, uh, yeah, he's, he's pretty cool. I don't mind him at all. So, uh, to unlock him, you will actually unlock Simon Baz appropriately on the seventh level of the game, which is Oa No, and this is where you will find him. So once you have him there, you will be able to unlock him in the game and uh, put him with the rest of the Green Lantern Corps. I will do a video featuring all the members of the Green Lantern Corps. And uh, it's funny that Badge is in this game because Badge was actually one of the characters or was that found Simon and uh, figured out exactly what was going on and you know helped work with him uh, in getting him all kind of caught up to speed with the Green Lantern Corps and, and all that kind of stuff. So it's kind of funny. You can kind of get a sense uh, with the characters and, and some of the characters in the game, like when they kind of started putting that together and just how long the development of this game was, has been going on uh, because, you know, Badge and Simon Baz, and then of course we've got Jessica Cruz, who's a little bit more of a, a recent Green Lantern edition. All pretty cool. And I know there's a lot of people that are probably like, oh, where's Guy Gardner? Where's Kyle Rayner? You know, where's all these other, you know, lanterns that are probably a little bit more famous? Uh, and, you know, the, the long and short of it is there is no shortage of lanterns that you can put in this game. And we've already seen those guys. And, you know, we've seen Kilowog. And there's been a lot of Green Lanterns in the game. And now we're looking at two of the newest characters. And the thing that you have to remember about these games is they are also promotional pieces for DC Comics. Their hope is that you're going to see these characters and say, I want to know more about Simon Baz. I want to know more about si uh, Jessica Cruz. Who are these characters? Maybe I can buy a comic book. So it's kind of a two-way street if you think about it. And yes, they want to put fan favorite characters in the game that a lot of people you know relate to and appreciate and know and love. And then they're going to feature some kind of offbeat characters. Not that I'm calling Simon Baz or Jessica Cruz that. They are literally the characters that are on the cover of every Green Lantern comic book that's out right now. I mean, Hal Jordan is off. I think he has like his own book. So, I mean, everybody else is doing something else and, or pop up in the Green Lantern books. But it very much focuses on these two right here. So, 
I think it's good. And I mean, I don't know how many... <laughs> it feels like... I thought every sector was supposed to have one Green Lantern. Maybe they've changed that. Um, but I don't know. It kind of feels weird that there's like so many Earthling Green Lanterns at this point. Because besides these two, you also have Hal Jordan, you know, Kyle Rayner, uh, Guy Gardner, John Stewart. I mean, there's a lot of Earthlings that are uh, uh, sitting there chucking rings and wielding rings and slinging rings. That's that's the phrase I'm looking for. So let's look at what Simon does. I mean, I'm pretty sure he's going to do everything that the other Green Lanterns do. Um, so we've got beam deflect, flight, grapple, illumination, shield mode, photo mode. Lantern Construct, Impact Switch, Vent Travel, X-Ray Vision. Forced into becoming a car thief to make ends meet, Simon Baz found himself wrongly imprisoned for a major crime. Mistreated by his captors, Simon was located by a Green Lantern ring containing the spirit of Hal Jordan and Sinestro, turning him into the latest Green Lantern to guard Earth. Uh, first appearance, New 52, Free Comic Book Day, Special Edition number 1, 2012. Uh, Green Lantern of 2814. I hope that's what I said. I feel like I might have said 2804. No, I had to have said 14. E either way, I mean, this is Simon Baz. Um, you know, it's pretty cool. I, I like it. I like... See, this is the type of thing, as far as, like, representation, I can really get behind. Because I think it's important to have characters that, you know, people can look at and say, Hey, that's just like me. You know, I just hate it. I always hate it when it's done at the expense of another character. And I don't feel like this was done at the expense of Hal Jordan or at the expense of Sinestro, you know? And they were able to focus on a couple new characters and uh, it works out really well. So that is Simon Baz. Hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you.